So here we have the purple filter for the ocular lens of the PVS-14 from LLI. The point of this filter is to kind of reduce some of the green color that you get from green phosphor tubes and bring it back to more of a black and white like you'd see with white phosphor. Uh, the way to install this thing is you're going to remove the eye cup piece right here. You can put a little flat piece of metal or uh, some might just be loose enough to begin with inside these two little notches and that'll allow you to unscrew this piece right here. Then you can take your purple filter, being careful not to touch the inside of the lens, and screw that over. It's kind of nice also, it provides some extra protection for the lens on your 14 itself. But once you have it in, you can see that uh, it's nice and flat, it doesn't take up any more room than the stock configuration did but you do lose your ring to hold your eye cup. So if you want to run an eye cup, then uh, you'll probably have to mod this in some way or just glue it on. Um, but with this filter, the need for eye cup is reduced a bit. Without this filter, I have a really bright light, a bright green light shining onto my eye. Uh, but with this filter on there, the amount of splash coming off my face is much less. So you can see the color difference looking through the filter it's just a slight hue of purple it's not like sunglasses or anything it's not making it darker it's just pushing the color palette in a certain direction so basically green the type of green that like the lighter yellowy green that comes out of uh, your standard green phosphor tube is going to be about opposite the color wheel of this tone of purple that's why it's not the same for every single tube because every tube is a little bit different but Generally, uh, whenever you filter a green light or any light with a filter that's opposite from the color wheel, you're going to be basically watching out its dramatic features and bringing it more to like black and white neutral ground. So that's what the thought is behind this filter. As, as the green light passes through the purple filter, purple being opposite on the color wheel, it'll uh, basically tone it down to where it's not going to have its drastic properties. So you end up with a much more docile image whenever it comes through this. And therefore, you're going to be having less light projected onto the face because the image itself is a, is a lot more flat. At least that's the best way I can think of to describe it. Um, I don't have any excess light. I'm just looking at a flatter image, and it's not uh, so shiny shining in my eye. I can still tell completely what's going on in the image, but um, it's just not as bright. Since I don't have gain control on this unit, uh, it was really helpful for me. If you have like a Gen 2 or Gen 2 Plus tube that uh, is already a little bit darker to begin with, uh, then this might not help you out as much. It might be a little bit too dark. You might need that those brighter hues of green to be able to tell what your image is and what you're looking at. But uh, for me at least, in my tube, it's definitely worth the uh, 30 bucks for this thing. So if you think you might uh, need something like this, try it out, give it a shot, use it some and uh, come back and let us know how it worked for you. But uh, anyways, there we go.